Hi YouTubers, this is your Ems and today I'm going to show you how to build a prototyping board for programming ATtiny 10, 9, 5 and 4 microcontrollers. In my previous video I showed you how to connect USB ASP programmer, yeah to these breakout boards but using wires it's not very uh, practical so I decided to build uh, this very simple uh, prototyping board yeah which should be easy to use and more reliable I'm going to need uh, these breakout boards which I built in one of my previous videos you can watch if you like and some header pins and a printed circuit board Okay, the socket for breakout boards is done and now I'm going to solder these header pins on sides, yeah. Okay, the header pins are already there and now I'm going to solder these header pins for connecting a programmer, yeah? Okay, all pin headers are in place. The programmer is going to be there like this. Yeah, it's much easier than using uh, unreliable wires. And breakout boards are going to be there like this. Yeah. For programming AT Tiny 10, 9, 5, and 4 microcontrollers, is used the uh, TPI communication protocol and in the next step I'm going to connect uh, the programmer pins with the breakout board pins yeah here I've already prepared wires yeah the red one is a uh, common voltage the black one is for ground the white one is for resetting microcontroller, the green one is a uh, clock and the blue one is uh, master out slave in and that's it. So I'm ready to solder it now. Okay, the wires are in place and I'm going to finish it now, yeah?
Okay, and that's it, yeah. The prototyping board is done, yeah. It's going to be more reliable, yeah, for programming than using wires. And I think I have everything I needed for programming these microcontrollers, yeah. So now it's time to connect uh, the programmer to my computer, yeah, and test uh, this prototyping board. I'm going to test it uh, the same way like in my previous video, yeah, using AVR Dude in version 6.3, yeah, and I'm going to repeat it again that uh, AVR Dude uh, is installed on my computer with uh, Arduino IDE, yeah, which contains uh, a VR toolchain and also if you want to use it like me in this video uh, you should uh, add these two directories to the path environment variable yeah if you want to use a VR dude from any directory and also have access to a VR dude configuration file I'm going to test ATtiny 10 breakout board yeah plugged to my new prototyping board yeah so the programmer is going to be USB ASP, microcontroller is uh, ATtiny10 and I'm going to read the flash of the microcontroller yeah and the content of the flash is going to be stored to the test file yeah and the last i means uh, that the file is hex file okay reading is all right and now i'm going to test writing yeah i'm going to write the same file which i read right now yeah i just need to change the letter r to w yeah which means write and also writing is all right so it looks like that uh, prototyping board is working yeah okay guys so i've done today uh this very simple prototyping board yeah for programming 80 tiny 10 9 5 and 4 microcontrollers and in my next videos you can look forward to yeah programming these microcontrollers so thank you for watching and see you next time